if you don't know who Chon Zappa, Japa Chonzandala, however you say this loser's name, aka cracked out Melissa McCarthy. <laughs> Yo, I've been getting a lot of comments, people saying, Yo, BX, that's that's mad disrespectful to Melissa McCarthy though, bro. Like you you're being foul for that. I know. Miss it's all right. And she should be cool. Anyway, I digress. You don't know who this channel is. She's a loser. Tries to cover whatever the hell she wants to cover. I think she wants to be like a trauma channel. Right? If you used to go to her content, it's more so just her poking fun and trying to come at people. But she's not really good at it, per se. A lot of true crime. Yeah, a lot of corny stuff. But the way this girl talks is like she's super famous. <laughs> the way this girl makes it seem... It's as if she's like a superstar. Especially when she's out here trying to strike people's channels down. I gave her some criticism. I thought I was going to, you know, just have to leave it at that. But then she decides to react to my, my content, which is fine, you know, especially if you're keeping it fair use. But then while doing so, she's threatening people to strike them down, including me. She says that I'm not worth her time, right? Now, if I think if I scroll down deep enough, pause, scroll down far enough. Unless she deleted it. Yeah. I think she did delete the post. <laughs> she deleted the post saying that like I wasn't worth her time and how like she was giving me publicity or some kind of BS, right? Giving me clout. And then what does this Felito do? She does another post. She deletes the previous post saying that I wasn't worth her time and I almost had her some BS. If I looked hard enough, I could probably find a screenshot of that. Right? But then she makes another one coping. With the craziest cope of all time. I got destroyed, guys. You ever seen that meme where it's like a cry face emoji? It's like a person <laughs> pretending that they're smiling and laughing, but behind their mask, tears are coming down. If you were unbothered, you wouldn't say anything. Right? Isn't that what normal people do when they're unbothered? Me, I'm treating you like content. I like roasting wokies and losers that try to emotionally manipulate and do a lot of nasty things. You're abusing the copyright system and blatantly say, hey, even if YouTube allows the video back up that I false copyright strike, I'm going to strike it again. You're threatening people, saying that you're going to go real life on them, but then lie straight to my face. You said you're unbothered, but once again, the lie detector test determined that is a lie. <laughs> you are bothered. You are extremely bothered because you're a loser with nothing else better to do in your life other than for you, your loser dad, your loser mama, right? Your daddy and mama, and your losers, they ain't got nothing better to do, right? <laughs> but they watch you all day, and there's a lot of people saying, but what's wrong with her parents being in her, her comment sections, in her live chats? Well, when you got them making threats, I, I, would, I would say that's probably a, an issue when the father is going around saying that he's willing to pay any amount of money to get people's personal information. Whoa. Now, whoa there. That sounds a little too far. This Jabalapa, whatever her name is. And let me, let me put a picture just in case I see people saying, who are we talking about? Let me show you what she looked like. <laughs> let me show, let me show you. Let me briefly show you. Who are you talking about right, right now? And so you can see they have a clear indication right there. There you go. There you go. This is who we looking at. This is who we talking to. A wannabe woke loser. If you guys don't know, I like calling out these woke losers. It makes me laugh. It makes me laugh. I'm talking about that good old belly laugh. I'm talking about that good old Nelson from The Simpsons. Ha ha laugh. Right? Laughing at this cornball loser. Let's keep reading what she said. I got destroyed, guys. If you could kill, <laughs> consider calling someone a retarded B word, destroying them. Wow. So that's, that's all we got. We didn't get me pretty much proving to the world that you're a liar. You saying, Oh, I didn't threaten somebody and then threatening them right in front of my face. No. Nah, you admitting that you just be talking just to talk and you just say things whenever you get emotional. Your security guard coming on and threatening me on panel. Nah, none of that. You just going to take all of that and just 
condense into just, he called me a retarded B word. Well, you call people racist. So <laughs> I think if you accuse people of just being racist in random conversations, just because you feel hurt and you get emotional, I think you could take being called the R word. What do you think? Let's do a poll. Let's do a poll in the live chat. Let's do a poll in the live chat, right? Let's see. If you can call people racist, can you be called retarded? <laughs> Or is that too far? Too far. There you go. Let's see. Yeah, yes, no. If you can call people racist, <laughs> you be called retarded, or is that too far? Yes or no? We did a poll. We got a poll going. I want you guys to vote. I want you guys to vote, and I also want you to hit that like button. That's what I want you guys to do. Don't worry. I'm going to drop the link so people could call in if they want to actually, you know, give me their opinion. All right. Uh, let's see. Destroying them. Well, then you're lame. Why cry face? <laughs> and then you took the time to, <laughs> to screenshot, which means you were watching. Which means you were watching, by the way, just in case you didn't know. Let me pull it up a little bit further. This means you were watching, shorty. And then you screenshot it. Seems no one gave a F. Now, guys, this is what I'm talking about. This is a prime example. Every time I tell you that these grifters, all they care about is numbers, right? They don't care about no one. They just blatantly, blatantly care about numbers, money, whatever they can get out of you. How could, how could they lie in their pockets? They say they care about some of these true crime cases. They lying. Because why? When I go up to your panel, I confront you. I expose all the lies you tell. Your response is to shame me for my view count. She screenshots of 48, which is actually pretty good, honestly. This is pretty decent right, for me. I'm not really, um, even though I started off as a live streamer, I would say more of my fan base is for video uploads, right? Um, I bet you, you never dropped a video to get, ever got any kind of view. That I got video wise, but I don't really care about views, right? No, 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 no. When I live stream, it's to talk to you guys. It's the kick is to give an entertaining show, educational value, as well as comedy, right? It's not like, oh, no, there's not like a hundred people in here. So clearly I'm not important. Like, what kind of, that's literally saying the 48 people who were in here are nothing. Nobody. Were no one gave it so the 48 people in here was watching me. You know, there's no one whoever's watching me right now. I'm not even looking at the amounts of people that's watching me right now, though. There are no ones. What if your fans was in here watching? Are your fans no one? Do you see the way these guys talk about you guys? You see the way they talk about y'all? I'm telling you that they only use you, they do not care, right. At least I'm letting you know I'm for entertainment value. I'm going to make you laugh, help you get through your day easier. This loser, this loser out here threatening people. Let's look at the comments. I mean, you, you guys were brave enough <laughs> to comment publicly. Let's, let's take a look. Let's take a look. <laughs> put them on the screen. Put them on the screen. All right, let's go. Ha, 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 smug face. Okay. Love you, gal. <laughs> and 48 people were watching. Yikes. Oh, she replied to that. Let's see. Let's see how she jokes about a whole 48. <laughs> you see, guys? That's all you are to them. It's just a number. When I told you guys that, and they tried to say I was lying, look, they approved it. Approved it. Look at this. A whole 48. They're shaming me for having low views, not for, you know, making valid points, of course. I've been trying to follow you now for a while, catching up to your lives. They deleted. it. Yeah, she definitely deletes her live streams. 100%. I think she removed, if I'm not mistaken, the one that I was on. Thank you for saying don't use the R word. <laughs> <laughs> huh? 
I've seen so many people outrage about the N word, people who were classified as R word back in the day. It's a medical diagnosis. No, it's not. Shut up. <laughs> if you don't identify as as it, how? All right. Uh, same should be for the R word. Uh, if you live in, well, let me see. Uh, these people to this day don't get the same respect or opportunity as everyone else. If a live can be shut down for the N word, same should be for the R word. Y'all, whoa. See, look, this is why I call people like this out. These are a bunch of cancel culture vultures. They wanted the live to be shut down. Wow. Yikes. He's trying right now. Don't promote his name. <laughs> yes, because I need all the promo from a channel for one tenth of my size. This is my second channel, guys. My main channel is uh, just BX Beast Boy. But yeah. So as you can see, no valid argument. And like lied multiple times, caught in multiple lies. But what's the response? You don't get as many views as me. I'm a grifter. Well, I don't think I would get as many views as the grifter when I'm doing things the honest way. But whoever's here for me, I earned it. And I appreciate all of them. I don't care if there's one person in here, two people. In, thank you. I've been in here with one person in streaming, especially when I go on Twitch. I might have one person watching me on Twitch right now. <laughs> thank you, one person. I appreciate that. Thank you for everyone who watches me. Right, I don't care about the, the number. I don't look at the number. I really do think that with live streamers, that's something that's distracting. Don't look at the number of people watching you. Don't look at that. You want to look at it after the fact, okay. But focus on the show. I dance with the ones who brought me to the party. I don't know how many times I gotta keep saying that. I dance with the ones who brought me to the party. So I don't care what number it is. The people that are supporting me, that's watching me, that rocks with me. That's who I'm going to rock with. I don't care about the number. Like what? And if you hear anyone bragging about that or using that as a way to, I guess, shut you down and say that you don't have any valid points, that would be just false. It would, it would be corny. And it's a clear sign that these people don't have any kind of like, I don't know. How do you say it? They don't stand for anything. They don't have any integrity. Their morals is suspect. A whole plethora of things. Quality over quantity. There you go. There you go. Exactly. See? BX, my comment wasn't approved by her. So she's, look, she's screening her comments. That's how scared she is of the fan gang. That's how scared she is. She kicks me off panel, has a security guard. I couldn't even go on her panel without her having a whole security guard there, fam. I walked in, she was Stop in there. Stop Stop That's how she was in there, fam. She had a whole security guard. I'm like, damn, should I, I should have brought my crew. <laughs> I should have came with my crew. If that's what you want to do, I got to come. You got this simp on panel. Leave my homegirl alone. Leave my homegirl alone. I need as many brownie points as possible because I could never get a girl to look at me any other time. Call, call. Let me be the tough guy on the internet. Let me, let me have a cartoon image that were drawn on muscles. Who? Oh, yeah. And then they threatened me, talking about they're going to beat me up. Man, shut your ass up. You listen, this is what you do. You sit there, y'all press buttons, okay? You press mother effing buttons, and then you sit there, you lie. That's what you do. You sit there, and you put on a clown show for me to look at and roast. That's what you're good at. Put on a clown show. Putting on a clown show. Trying to shame me for views. I'm happy for my views. I don't know what you're talking about. I remember a time when nobody cared what I had to say. Right? And I'm talking about before I was a YouTuber. Just a kid growing up in the Bronx. I'm happy for all my views. I'm blessed. I realize how blessed I am every day. So F this loser. <laughs>